namaste i love you jbn we keep you informed eight year old feeds homeless for her birthday please remember to like subscribe share leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items most children look forward to celebrating their birthdays and being showered with lavish parties and gifts but for courtney Graves, who turned eight on march 14 she wanted to mark the occasion by giving back to the less fortunate courtney who attends jesse paul primary school on south camp road in kingston tells jis that she was led by the voice of god to feed children and the homeless these people are in need of somebody to care for them some of them are hungry and have nothing to eat she says courtney would later approach her mother tanya lord and greaves with the idea but was not immediately taken seriously however courtney was persistent and returned to her mother days later with her plan to feed children at the maxfield park children's home and the glen hall place of safety and homeless people on king street and its environs halfway tree and crossroads After celebrating a quiet birthday, Courtney, her mother, a few relatives and friends set out on March 16 and 17 to feed the homeless and wards of the state, serving meals of rice, chicken, curried mutton, and an assortment of vegetables. I spent well over $10,000. Courtney and I went to downtown and we got all that we needed, Lord and Greaves told JIS News. She says that her daughter has always had a yearning to serve and help people. I think there's a natural spirit growing within her that will take her to the level that she needs to be. She keeps saying to me that it's not what you get, it's what you give. Service to people and children is important to her, she notes. Loud and Greaves says she's proud of her daughter's sense of philanthropy and commitment to such a worthy cause. She stands as proof that one is never too young to make a difference. Outside of Courtney's goodwill, the eight-year-old has won a number of accolades from participation in various Jamaica Cultural Development Commission JCDC activities. In 2017, she was a gold medalist for Kingston and St. Andrew in the JCDC National Speech Competition.
JBN. We keep you informed. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.